Hello, I'm ADR Director Kyle Phillips, and I'm here to talk to you about the coolest mage in all of Fiore, Grateful Buster. We're continuing our year-long celebration of Fairy Tale with Grey Week, and uh, we'll be looking at his top five moments as voted on by you, the fans. I remember every single battle that I've had to fight, and that's what gives me my power. I'm gonna wipe that smirk off your face for good with the power of my memory. Number five, Gray versus Rufus. You know, just the whole Grand Magic Games arc uh, is just one of the best arcs I think in the show. It's you know just that whole tournament aspect. Everyone loves tournaments, but this fight specifically, Gray versus Rufus. Uh, anytime you have Maker versus Maker Magic, it's always fun because it's just kind of who can one up the other one with their uh, different kinds of magic. <laughs> All right, I'm through playing around. You shouldn't be able to move right now. Don't tell me what to do. We don't get to see Gray fight too often, like by himself, like just really him versus someone else. So to see him using his uh, ice make magic as uniquely as possible because uh, he has to fight against Rufus who has memory make magic and we haven't seen that before. And so it's how he can maneuver around that stuff and he just, overwhelms his memory. But that's impossible! How can he create so much at once? Did you get all that? And so just seeing that progression of Gray kind of figuring that out, but it, like still taking the hits and taking the hits, you know, talking about um, uh, he takes that big fire blast from Rufus, you know, but it Gray brushes it off because he's dealt with Natsu's flames, uh, and so Rufus's flames are nothing compared to Natsu. So just seeing him overcome these different physical uh, hurdles um, to then at the end uh, figure out a way to defeat Rufus, uh, it was a cool little uh, moment for Gray. Number four. 